This work is essentially looking at the amount of irrigation required for um, landscapes, so not just one type of plant but mixed species landscapes that we actually see in, in Florida, and also determining the minimum amount of irrigation that can sustain those landscapes uh, with good quality. We picked uh, common turf grass and um, uh, woody ornamental species that were very common in Florida landscapes, probably found in almost any Florida landscape. We mix those in large tanks, uh, we call those lysimeters, where we can capture all the water inputs and all the water outputs and, and measure those so we can figure out how much water those plants, those landscapes are actually using. The work that we're doing here builds upon at least 70 or 80 years of, of research on um, energy balance uh, approach to determining evapotranspiration. Some of the results from this project indicate that uh, under, during peak periods that uh, mixed species landscapes can receive irrigation uh, anywhere from once a week to every one and a half weeks or so and still maintain very good quality. So that's good news. That means that the one day week restrictions in this case uh, where we're, we're customizing the irrigation for those landscapes um, can work. But the difference is with water use restrictions, it's a it's a one day a week, it's Monday every week. Whereas in this case, we're giving it the day that it needs it. It's a big difference. Essentially came to the conclusion that many landscapes are over irrigated to the tune of two to three times what they need. A critical piece of this, this whole picture of water in our environment is uh, water quality. We've talked about water quantity and we've often done projects where we've worked on water quantity, but not quality. But it, it's really a system. You have to think of every aspect of it we need to back the water off and uh, work on the water quality aspects while still providing a, a product or a landscape that is aesthetically pleasing. I hope that the information that uh, we've developed here, partnering with, with a public agency, that information could then be taken and, um, and used to optimize the amount of water that, that uh, people in real landscapes and in real homes and businesses are using. Thank you.